Emma Raducanu has revealed that her U.S. Open trophy is not being kept at her home. The Bromley teenager wrote her name in the history books as she became the first qualifier to win a major last month, but has now lifted the lid on the reason the trophy isn't in her possession. Raducanu is currently playing just her second tournament since her historic U.S. Open victory. After making an unsuccessful return to competition in Indian Wells, where she lost her first match to world number 100 Alexandra Sasnovich, the 18-year-old is now competing in the Transylvania Open. Despite being the world number 23 and a Grand Slam champion, Raducanu had never recorded a victory on the WTA Tour until she arrived in Romania this week. The teenage sensation won her first tour match against world number 124 Polona Hercog on Tuesday, October 26, in what was also her first, and so far only, three-set match at tour level. Following her third-round victory over Romanian Anna Bogdan, Raducanu revealed that her U.S. Open trophy was not being kept at home, and explained why she decided to give it away. It's stored at the National Tennis Center I'm pretty sure, in London, the 18-year-old said, following her 6-3 6-4 victory over the world number 106. It's not at home. If you want to see it, it's at the NTC. Raducanu, who is competing in her father's home country of Romania for the first time, lifted the lid on her decision to give the trophy to the Lawn Tennis Association. She said, I just thought that the LTA have done so much for me and I just wanted them to have it as a sign and a big thank you for everything that they've done for me, helping me through the young ages. They've played a huge role in my development so yeah, it's a little gift. The world number 23 was raised in Kent, after being born in Canada to a Chinese mother and a Romanian father. She has spent several years training at the LTA's base in the National Tennis Center, and has recently been working with several LTA coaches. However, Raducanu remains without a coach in Romania after parting ways with Richardson, who was one of her LTA youth coaches, following her U.S. Open title win. The Grand Slam champion said she was looking for someone with more tour-level experience, and has since issued a plea for any experienced coaches to step forward. She was said to be undergoing a trial period with Esteban Carroll, the former coach of fellow Brit Johanna Conta, who has also spent time working with the LTA, but arrived at the Transylvania Open with just her father and physio. While competing in Indian Wells, where she also arrived without a coach, Raducanu also sought advice from another LTA coach, Jeremy Bates, who had initially travelled with fellow British player Katie Bolter. 